After now, the Voices of Resilience exhibit at the Springfield Museums highlights stories of women who've changed history. 22 News reporter Katrina Kincaid spoke with the museum for Black History Month about the women featured. At the Springfield Museums, there's an exhibit highlighting historical women's voices, most with local connections. They wanted to make a change, and they did it in their own um, individual ways and made things better for everybody. That's what this exhibit is about. The women in the Voices of Resilience exhibit refused to let things that weren't right continue. For Black History Month, the museum showed us some of the featured black women. So here you can come and learn about Mum Bet, who was a woman who was enslaved, who sued for her own freedom and won it in the 1700s. Baypath University professor Janine Fondon is the exhibit curator. Her aunt won the right to sit anywhere on the bus after suing 10 years before Rosa Parks. And you can learn about modern day women. Ruth Carter, the Springfield native costume designer for Black Panther is featured. So is Denise Jordan, director of the Springfield Housing Authority, former first black Springfield chief of staff and community leader. So much so that she was recognized with a Eubora Award. The Eubora Award is an award um, given by the Springfield Museums for an African American person who has made a tremendous contribution to their community. The latest addition are portraits from Cora Swan, the granddaughter of former state representative and civil rights activist Ben Swan. The exhibit at the Demore Museum of Fine Arts goes through March 14th. Working for you in Springfield, Katrina Kincaid, 22 News.